John Stewart is going after the Biden administration once again. On Monday's episode of The Daily Show, Stewart took a wellness check on the war on Gaza, pointing out the double standards between the U.S. government's response to the Ukraine-Russia conflict and that over the war in Gaza. Stewart focused on how the U.S. condemned Russian aggression against Ukraine, particularly Russian attempts to target and suppress the free press and weaponize food shortages against Ukrainians, which the U.S. has described as unconscionable. There is a literal famine in Gaza caused by the war. I assume America will also consider this unconscionable. Stewart then showed the Biden administration deflecting questions or expressing only concern about Israel's push to suppress and target the press in Gaza rather than condemning it. If it is true, uh, a move like this is concerning. Oh, we're concerned again. <laughs> How about if it's true, we condemn it. He then moved on to the issue of recent land seizures, describing the bedrock rule of international law as being no taking of land. When Russia does it, we're pretty clear. The entire world has a stake in making sure that no nation, no aggressor, is allowed to take a neighbor's territory by force. Stewart noted, but in the midst of that, they pulled a little something in the West Bank on March 22nd that might be notable. The Israeli government announced that it was declaring state land, nearly 2,000 acres of land, in the occupied West Bank. Stewart exclaimed, why do we tiptoe around on eggshells? Every time America tells the world that there's something we won't allow, Israel seems to say, challenge accepted. <laughs> Are they willfully trying to provoke us? He concluded, the subtext of all this is America knows this is wrong, but apparently it doesn't seem to have the courage to say it in a straightforward manner. For more on Jon Stewart's comments, head to THR.com. And for the latest entertainment news and updates, keep watching The Hollywood Reporter News.